It's been a minute, but it is summer, officially. This week, I got out on Wednesday, and it is Friday. It has been probably mm, over a month since I have filmed the video. The end of the year was really tough, and I just did not have the energy or the mindset to do a video. Oh my goodness, I need to sleep. I've had the mask. Mass fly murder, and there's still flies everywhere this morning. Well, good morning. I'm sure your YouTube friends have missed you. What do you guys think? Hi. My big girls. Hi, Dolly. All the babies have names. I will tell them to you after breakfast. Should you do one. All right. Let's have breakfast. Yes, there are way too many goats in here. So this is just to continue to expand. Uh, and one of oldest is in here now. No idea why. Uh, he started coming in yesterday. You know, Nani and her babies, Poppy and her babies, and Bunny. And now uh, his eldest little boy. He's back in, looks dirty, so I need to check on that. <laughs> Make sure he's not got coccidia or something. He shouldn't, but time of year we have not had the rain this last month that we've needed. Good morning. Good morning fellas and piggles. <laughs> It is June 2nd and it is already pretty warm. Uh, upper 80s, 88% humidity out this morning, so that's pretty toasty. What do you think, Twizzer? Net has been working. I've never electrified it, but if I take it down, pork chop definitely, I think, would lift the metal gate and go through. He comes and checks every morning to make sure that that wire, that uh, net is still there and attempts to lift it up with his nose. So it's working, but we are on full, full acreage. Uh, we've mowed this a couple of times to get it, um, you know, last year's dead grass gone and get it restarted. They've eaten it. We've had to mow it once just because it's gotten so tall. My charger is struggling again. I think it's just five nets. We've kind of decided that the charger is not like five nets is the max for that charger and with like anything that grounds it out like the dew or um, rain or anything it just the battery can't last. It's too many nets because if I have it on three nets 
and never have any issues. So it may upgrade to the bigger charger and then use that charger for some of these other systems. All right, littles. All right, my littles. We gotta pick our balls up. Okay, so I just gave him a shot of Corid, not a shot, but like a, a drench of this. We just did a prevent not too long ago. I'd already prevented a feed for them because they all eat together, but we will treat him for the next five days with that. So, baby names. While we're here, and we'll check all the other little booties. So you guys know these guys. So Paprika, Cinnamon, Dahlia, and Alfalfa. So let's go talk about the new babies who are all about a month old now. So this little guy that was in the milk room is Zelda's little boy. That's Bowser. And these are his sisters. Um, so this one is Peach. And this one is Evie. Let's check their booties. She looks clean. They look clean. It may be that he just had more grain yesterday and that upset his stomach, but I'm not going to take any chances. Leia, who's Padme's. And then, hey Tinker. Charming, who's Pixie's little boy, and Snow, Pixie's little girl. It's so my fourth graders in Miss Newmeyer's class at one of my elementary schools named the Zelda's Three because I could not. Figure it out, could we, Paprika? The end of the school year was really, really tough for me. I am very burned out and just not mentally in a great headspace. And so I just decided to take some time off after the babies were born, mostly because I like could not physically make myself do anything. I was so tired. Uh, I couldn't even come up with the energy to name the babies. So I let my fourth graders do that. And I think they, they came up with like a whole list and those were the ones that I picked. Uh, they did such a great job. Please don't bite me. Baby child, these still are my babies and are just my best friends. Uh, these guys are warming up to me slowly. Spending more time out here now that summer has started. This is my third day off. Say hi mama. So, can you please get down? Thank you. Those are the baby names. I hate that he's a little bit poopy. We'll watch everybody. We'll probably, if I can catch them, start another round of, they've all had a round of coccidia prevent, but we'll do another just to make sure. It is very warm and sticky this morning. I'm already sweating and it's like 8.20. It's gonna be a hot summer if it keeps up like this with no rain. Everybody's doing really great. The farmer has been struggling, but all these guys are doing really well. Hi, Dolly. Hi, my Dolly. So she and Al, uh, who were terrified of me, when I came back from our trip, so like the day after a Pixie's babies were born, we went to Orlando for a week, and then like when I came back, they were like this. So I don't know what my mom and dad did, but they are crazy friendly. We just have to figure that out for the rest of these little guys. But they're finally in the like about a month old stage where they're eating grain and pretty curious about life. What do you think, Tink? Say, what do we think? Hmm? I know. Uh, Leia is still probably the most skittish. And these two, three, are kind of coming up to me and following the other babies and kind of seeing what's, what's up. Uh, I got them a lick tub 
last weekend. They've almost completely devoured it. Yeah, just for the mamas for some extra protein. Everybody's been really healthy. I don't think that they're gonna walk out with me today. We'll see. Come on, goats! Come on, goats! Come on, babies! Let's go! Let's go, goats! There's Tooney. I'm gonna make sure she can't get through. Come on, babies! Come on, babies! So I mowed this last weekend because it was up above my knees. This is the second time I mowed this plot. Come on, girls! You have to mow it when it seeds out and it starts shading the undergrowth because then underneath it'll just all be dead. They have not cut hay yet. Come on, baby goat! Oh, we got three. Come on, girls! Come on! Let's go! Maybe. Pixie. Pixie's always out here. Ready to go. And her babies are growing, like, they're huge, especially charming. When I took them to get disbudded, the vet was like, are you sure they're only two weeks old? Because they were so big and they are the youngest, so. Good job, Mama Goat. Come on, Charming. Where's your sister? Where's Snow? Mmm, he's got a sticky butt too, it looks like. And he will be about impossible to catch, so I'll have to get him tonight when they're all up. But looks like they could all use another round. Um, they've been out here for two weeks, I think, on the full, and we really had been rotating pretty much every other week, and we won't be ready to rotate because we've not had any rain. They'll have to kind of figure it out. It's really long in the back, but not as long as I would like it to be this time of year, but we'll do the best that we can. So yeah, hopefully this summer, at least two videos a week. I know we've been basically down to one video during the school year. It was a really, really tough school year for me, and so... Hopefully with some rest, I'll get back up to two videos a week, uh, especially when the babies are here. The big girls are about ready to go, but I haven't even listed them. And the market is not great right now. I don't, I don't think they'll be going anywhere anytime soon. Well, uh, Jeremy's off work today. He took the day off to go to uh, baseball at Spaceball Regional for U of A this weekend. And so we have tickets and he's going with his dad today. I'm supposed to hang out with one of my friends. If that doesn't happen, then I'm probably gonna go meet them at least for the night game. Let me go help him get his tailgating stuff ready to go. Yeah, so glad to be back. Thank you guys for hanging in with me and I promise lots of baby goat content for the next few weeks.